the United States has a moral and legal obligation to provide reparations for the enslavement of Africans. Black people in our country cannot wait any longer for our government to begin a, a addressing each and every one of the extraordinary bits of harm, all of the harm it has caused since the founding. Well, the federal government backed slavery, right? The federal government was the facilitator and nurturer of the transatlantic slave trade. So the federal government needs to hold itself accountable uh, for that. <sighs> and then policies that have uh, continued throughout American history have continued to inflict harm on black Americans. Oh, wait, 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 how much is all this going to cost me? Uh, Cory Bush introduced a resolution for federal reparations. That, you knew that was coming. The Missouri Democrat is calling for a $14 trillion in payments for black Americans. <laughs> we care about our reparations, and we have to put white people on notice that we want our reparations. I'm demanding that we have $5,000 every single month to the day we die. The United States has a moral and legal obligation to provide reparations. So the federal government needs to hold itself accountable. So let's get the money. Where's the money? True liberation starts with money. I want 20 million in 50. 20 million in 50. 20 million in 20. 20 million in 20s. And 10 million in 10. And 10 million in 10s. You want any fives with that? Reparations is now. Pay the debt, cut the check, or no reparations, no vote 2024. My God. Money, money, money.